Namaste. So we are studying the letters. Varna, Akshara, Letter or Alphabet. We know that there are Swaras and Vyanjanas. Vowels and Consonants. When we talk about consonants, we see that there are five vargas, five groups, classes. Kavarga, Chavarga, Tavarga, Tavarga and Pavarga. These five vargas have five varnas in each varga. So that way, five varna multiplied by five vargas, they are twenty-five. These twenty-five letters are called sparsha. The literal meaning of this word sparsha is touch. So, these sparshas are called so because while pronouncing all of these letters, our tongue completely touches some part or the other in our oral cavity. So these 25 are called sparsha. Then ya, ra, la, va are called antastha and sha, sha, sa and ha. These four letters are called ushma. Besides them, there are a yoga vaha. There are four a yoga vahas. They are jihva muliya, upadmaniya, anuswara, and visarga. We will see each one of them when it is time to study them. Now, when I want to call out one letter, let's say P or A or E, and if I am saying that one letter in a sentence, then that letter may get lost in the sentence. Suppose I want to talk about E. You know this letter E is very interesting. So in talking about that E, just to give it some weightage and to give it some shape and form, enough to stand out that we are talking about this E. So we put a suffix as kar, kar. So if I want to talk about e, I would say e kar. If I want to talk about a, I would say a kar. This suffix is added only to give it some body, some weightage, some volume, so that it becomes more tangible when we are talking about one particular letter. So this is the way to talk about any letter. Akara, Ikara, Pakara, Kakara. But there is one letter to which this kara is not added. That one letter is ra. If I want to talk about ra, to ra we add something called ipha. And because of 
some rules of sandhi here it will become repa repa only with one letter that is ra so ra is not rakara ra is repa so this is how we address any letter when we want to talk about them with this we are ready to get into knowing each and every letter more deeply and also we are ready to learn the sthana of each of the letters so all the very best to you